October is National Domestic Violence Awareness Month. And News 6 is teaming up with Harbor House to help those directly affected in our community. Yeah, we are raising money to help Harbor House provide much needed services and shelter. You can donate right now at ClickOrlando.com. But we also want to show you how your money can help. Here's News 6's Crystal Moyer. Harbor House of Central Florida offers court advocacy services with its own office inside the Orange County Courthouse. The advocates helping survivors through the injunction process. Some people call it an order of protection. Through our county, we call it injunction processes, but it's an order for the other person that's hurting you to stay away from you. Regina Taylor has been working for Harbor House for nearly 20 years and says she's heard every difficult reason why a survivor stays with their abuser. Staying because of finances or trying to stay because of the children or trying to stay thinking that they can change the other party. Harbor House walking survivors through a safety plan, help apply for victim relocation funding, referrals to legal aid, and assistance in filing injunctions, all free of charge. <laughs> Nearly 1,000 injunctions were filed in the last fiscal year through Harbor House, up 27 percent. CEO Michelle Spurzel saying the numbers rising during COVID. And we know when the economy goes down, domestic violence goes up. So we're already seeing an increase in domestic violence. While the need for services for domestic violence survivors goes up, Spurzel says donations are going down and is encouraging everyone to give back to their community, even if it's just having a conversation about the resources available to help someone that may be in a dangerous situation at home, someone like Chrissy. I was struck in front of my son. I remember looking at him and seeing the fear in his face. In that moment, I knew by any means necessary, I had to go. She shares her story of survival and how Harbor House changed her life on News 6 at 530. In Orlando, Crystal Moyer, Getting Results, News 6.